head. I have a cold, uh, so please uh, n understand that sometimes my thought process actually functions more logically than it will as you watch. Uh, no. All right, so we're playing Child of Light. Child of Light is a traditionally uh, a game start set up as essentially it's side scrolling, not side scrolling. Really. Well, yeah, it's side scrolling. Uh, but with uh, traditional RPG turn-based combat system with some uh, differences based on timing, primarily. And ways to time attacks. Traditional use of different weaknesses based on elements uh, in combat. And also the new innovation. I think it's innovation. I've not seen it in games before and it's taken me a while to get used to of being able to mess with timing of both the enemy's attacks and your attacks uh, to interrupt and to speed up attacks. So that's Child of Light in terms of mechanics, in terms of the story. So far we are a, I think a 10 year old princess? Young at least, who not princess. I think she's a duke's daughter, actually, and it looked like she was in a kind of a, a, a Weimar Republic kind of Austrian or French or some kind of Victorian era ishy 19th century kind of uh, European nation. Um, her, she looked like she had a mother who was mysterious, died or disappeared young. Uh, she was raised by her father, the Duke, who then married somebody else, it looked like, and maybe she's an evil stepmother. Uh, let's hope they didn't go with the evil stepmother trope, but maybe they did. Uh, anyway, on the day I think she mar he married her, Aurora got sick and um, came down with a fever, and she is either dead or in kind of a coma-like state. And then she woke up in this uh, fantasy land. A gentle fantasy land where everything rhymes, which is kind of irritating, and the rhymes are really overwrought and kind of overdone in some cases. Uh, they're a bit of a stretch. Um, and found a sword. She was given fairy wings. She's basically been told that she's supposed to go get the, um, I think, the Queen of Night, who I suspect will end up being her stepmother. And um, by working with the Queen of Night, uh, by defeating the Queen of Night, she can get access to the real world again. Uh, she's seen in an. So far, she's seen in a well that shows your heart's desire that her dad is her dad, the Duke. Duke seems to be sick and uh, from grief, so she's worried about him. These are people I turned back from being crows, which they were pretty cute as crows, and I'm kind of sad they aren't still crows. I mean, being yeah, a crow sounds pretty cool, but now they're like kind of little dwarf people. I have one in my party. I do have other party members. Right now, I have a a jester who's trying to find her brother who left to fight the Queen of Might, I think, and a, um, one, somebody from this village who's a young, uh, dwarf person. They reach maturity at 13, which, dear God, that would be a disaster, and he's apparently not brave enough yet for his culture, and he's like, oh, Jesus, take me with you so I can get, uh, brave. Personally, I think that's a bit rough because like dude helped me defeat three evil uh eels powered three evil elemental eels uh, just now so you know i feel like he he put in the work but apparently he doesn't think so don't be so hard on yourself man I'm just messing around what's that is that an enemy what are you? Ah, that's an enemy. I feel like there are some enemies that I'm actually not powerful enough to take on yet. Uh, I've had a few encounters and I'm like, I don't think this is going the way it should. <laughs> I don't like how this is going. It's perhaps better. So we'll see if this is one of those. I don't know. I made some damage there. Uh, this is wood. Act. Wood, I would think, fire. So you can see the system down here where you can slow things down uh, using my little firefly dude if I click on them. Yes, vulnerable to fire. And, okay, so he's a cast, fast cast. Um, and if I manage to hit them during their cast window, I interrupt them and they're start, they have to start over it. Um, kind of back at square one. You can have anybody in your party, which I thought was interesting. Um, He's a fast cast, so I'll keep targeted on him. 
both to get their attacks through before. Maybe it was potentially interrupted. Okay, I'm surprised I actually could take that one out. I wasn't expecting to be able to defeat these. Let's see. I don't really know how experience is divided up, so I am trying to get my party members all in to do each fight. Aurora is my primary, and these are my two other characters that I have. Finn, and I just forgot her name. I just brought her in and out. You saw her. I don't know what this guy is vulnerable against, really. I can also heal characters, so like I can use my Firefly to heal characters, which I forget all the time. The Firefly dynamic is a little tough if you have a hard time keeping track of the I wonder if he's vulnerable to fire. Let's see. Um, he looks wood. Yes, he is vulnerable to fire. She has fire on her weapon. Um, because I'm not a very good... I'm not a very good with attention person. So it kind of um, is a little tough for Mina. Both use the mouse to do things with this guy during a fight and to do the normal fight mechanics. Oh, I could go in there. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, you may notice that my exploration is erratic. This is just me. Um, I'm obsessive compulsive and. Uh, creates an interesting huh, conflict between A, I want to explore everything, and B, I find it stressful that I want to explore everything, uh, because sometimes it can make me go through the game and do things in a really repetitive or frustratingly, um, yeah. intricate or whatever fashion uh, so sometimes I'll decide to explore and sometimes I'll decide not to uh, well this is kind of working I mean I'm not doing my best at this but I'm not ah totally failing yet They let me land some. Ooh, treasure. Ah! Oh, I, 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 treasure chest, treasure chest, treasure Mostly the treasure chests are things I just ignore. Although I have equipped some of the weapon stuff. It's a button. Oh, okay. So now I can go up there. I know it didn't turn off that. Dun, 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 dun. And those are wishes, apparently. And they get me back health and experience and firefly-iness. Come on, I want to go. This does stop, I thought. Does it? Maybe it doesn't? Okay, it doesn't, I guess. Here. Alright, we have blocks now. Good, does that box do me? We don't know. Box is here. There's nothing, no point to getting up there. I'm trying to figure out. Oh, oh, okay. I think I see where we're going with this puzzle. Probably need this box up there. <laughs> see many times I got blown in a circle. Alright. <clears throat> here we go. There's nothing. Certainly there can be nothing I can do wrong by pushing it over here. So I th think now that I remember... There we go. No, let go of it, Sunny. Is it sunny? Hey, let go if it's sunny! Woo! Oh, well, okay, fine. So I have to go... There we go. Oh, this was totally optional, I guess. I felt like somewhere I was supposed to be going. These are all treasures. That's a permanent buff, which I have a few. I should use them. Huh. Okay. So that was all optional and just stuff I can get. Cool.
Hmm. I mean, it didn't really... None of that's, like, super, super exciting stuff, but... Permanent buff is good, I guess. If you're a stats obsessed person, you're watching me do this and going like, but permanent buffs are amazing! I am never in it for the stats. That is not my life. Also, it was permanent stat buff things. I'm always like, but I don't know who I like best yet. And seriously, who I like best is what's gonna make me choose who gets those permanent buffs. Like, I may have a main character, uh, but if I don't like them, then I'm not gonna... Mm -hmm. Is that somewhere I can go? I don't think so. Uh, then I'm not gonna... Well, I'm not gonna make my brain work for one thing. Uh, if I don't like a protagonist, what's gonna happen is I'm gonna go like, I don't care. This is my protagonist and they should be the top stats person. Uh, they aren't gonna get the top stuff. No, I dashed the wrong direction. And they'll just have to deal with, like, Frog and Chrono Trigger. I love Frog and Chrono Trigger! He the, he's the best! Okay, I got something there already. I don't even have to use Dash for half of this. Just good timing. Um. And, you know, I give them all the best stuff. So it's like, Celeste in Final Fantasy VI. She gets the best stuff! Um, Frog and Chrono Trigger, he gets the best stuff. Are you the most useful in battle? Who cares? I don't care, you're cool. This is not, if you like me, have a dad who's kind of not like that, you're probably like, dude, that's not. I always find things about dads kind of poignant or strange because there is this perception that fathers can kind of do everything and you know you get your father's day cards but you're like thanks dad for doing everything ever in my life and I'm like my dad mostly sat in the basement and did space stuff so <laughs> not feeling these cards but um Okay, I don't know who was imprisoned, but it's clear that there was, there's a division between our worlds and somebody was, probably the stepmother was exiled or some such. Exiled or some such. Yeah. Oh, but what was I talking about? I was talking about dads, right? Like, I don't know, who has that dad? I guess some, some people have a very warm relationship with their fathers, I'm sure. Um. I come from a family where we all are pretty much a little neurotypical in some way or another. Um, or at least we're interesting. And, like, my dad was not really involved in my life. And if he was there, he was fairly confusing. Especially as a young child who didn't understand. As a kid, you don't usually understand that your parents' reactions aren't to you, aren't about you necessarily. They can be caused by a lot of complicated stuff, so... Oops! Okay, narration. I keep forgetting I'm supposed to be looking for the sun or moon. The rhymes drive me slightly up the wall. Part of the reason I'm playing... No. I have no idea what they're talking about when they talk about that. Um, I guess I'm searching- I keep forgetting I'm searching for the sun and the moon. I think we've found the stars already, but I'm not sure. You think you know. Okay, she's just looking for her brother at the circus. 
This really, really drives me nuts. Like, I don't know if this is supposed to be a speech impediment or, a, like, she's a performer, so it's an act or so, or what. But, like, she doesn't rhyme. Um, and they correct her every single time. And it drives me up the wall. It's so repetitive. That's so rude. Like, if she actually has a speech impediment, it'd be like every time someone, a friend of yours with a speech impediment, every time they said something a little off, you corrected them every single time. Like, they didn't know that they'd said it that way. So, drives me nuts. Don't like it. <laughs> There's a rabbit. Or a, a mere cat. Hey, I can't do anything with you, but you're interesting. Eh, yeah, flutterfall. Sploosh! Yes, oddly enough, I can't... Really? Do, 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 do. There's none of that top. Where's it coming from? I see this shows several in the background. Mm -hmm. I have so many potions. This is also in games I tend to play that way. I'm like, look at all the stuff I have that I have never, ever, ever used. Poof. Oh. Doesn't do anything. I light it up, but that's it. Uh, should I attack you? Should I go down here? I don't, I don't know. So many questions. So few answers. Oh, there's a treasure chest down here. I've got stuff. I've got so much stuff. I should see if I think I have stuff on all my characters. Oculi. So instead of actual armor or anything, we just have these weapons that up our stats. And I think. Yeah, I still have mostly rough. I only have one tumbled with one. Map of Lemuria. Oh, right, I have a quest, actually. Let this guy knock at the Capelli village. Stardust covers. I'm not sure what Stardust. I guess Stardust is the stat buffs. Coffers are the... 43? I don't think I found it. Okay. Okay, so that's total. No? So, oh, these are all in the Matilda's forest. Their cabbage is all in the forest. Should I go back to this guy's house? And say if he's puzzled? I think I'm going to. There's a puzzle back here. A side quest I neglected. I don't know what happens if you get all the coffers and stardust. You probably just get buffs. Not buffs, uh, achievements. Which honestly mean just about nothing to me, but, you know, whatever. Some people learn to him. Not judging. Wee tree. I always wanted to fly when I was little. I mean, I'd still take it, but there are other powers that I'd be like, Shit, there are other things I want more! Number, I don't know. I have to think for a moment, but... I actually would enjoy invisibility. It'd be nice to just be able to go do whatever. Not really worry about... What you looked like, who saw you, or any of those complicated things. It'd be not nice. You know? I don't like it. I like it at least. Let's see, there's a house out here that I'm supposed to be. I can just fly all over him though, so um Oh, there's some down there. I don't know, can I go into his house? What was Oh, he needs me to attack the books think. So. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not to overstate the case. Let's get the spider first. Um, is that a wood spider? Are you made of wood, spider? <laughs> it's the same as a duck. Let's see. Let's see. We're gonna do her slashing everybody. Oh, we're not gonna make it with her. Oh, well. Oh, we did because of the interruption, okay. And he's not vulnerable to fire. They're vulnerable to fire, but... Hmm. I need to defend with him because he'll just get hit. Have her slash the spider. I'll just 
take care of that. Yeah, let's see. These are vulnerable to fire, we figured out. No matter what we do here, one of these is gonna get us. Let's see. We'll slow this one down. I'll slash this one. Right, let's see if we make it. Quake sounds like it might hit us both. No, it just hit one of us. That's cool. See, so once you get used to the timing thing, this actually, I, it's okay now. At first, I was like, this is driving me up a wall. He uses his pipe to cast smoke, which is kind of funny. Dude, you're only 13. Don't smoke. Anyway, I wish I got... Somebody leveled up! Even though she wasn't in- oh, she wasn't in the fight, though. So I guess- okay, I don't have to rotate them into the fight to get them experience points. It's cool. She's- I'm using as a healer. Um, she's just- he's a mage- a mage, obviously, and she's just prepared for us. That's what I'm trying to use them as. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I think I'm just taking care of the bugs. Is it on alert? I'll go away and see if it... Oh, fine. <laughs> so this quest proves that there are subquests. Uh, oh, I don't get my magic back. I wonder how I get my magic back. These are not vulnerable to fire. Let's try lightning on. They have a fast cast time. Yeah. Nope. Lightning doesn't do anything particular. Alright, that one's already almost dead, though. Oh, these probably get my magic points back. Silly me. I should always take these in every fight. There's no, they're a free resource, so no reason not to. So lightning doesn't do anything for these guys. Fire doesn't do anything. Let's try monsoon. Mm, that had an effect, but I think it was just normal. It wasn't vulnerability. I'll just knock this one since it's almost dead anyway. Good job. Did I get them all? <laughs> Listen to me. And uh, maybe this one I have to do too. Oh, it just started. It's a surprise strike. Okay. Do, 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 do. I should have used her skill points before I started because the point not. Act since we know this one's vulnerable against fire, we'll go ahead. I'm playing it on casual, so it's not meant to be particularly challenging. I still, you know, I have I've I've still had to think in the fights, which is nice. Oh, don't hit him. Um, but so it's not like brain dead level. But um, no, I don't want to flee. Ah, uh, what's cute? Okay. And but um, it's not so difficult that it will drive me up a wall. Okay. And this character's not, I'm not setting her up to be physically strong, so. She's this kind of support that I bring in candidly. Let's see, I mean, they might get me. Nope, not gonna get me. Cool. But she stopped, so she won't be to get to me for a bit. Let's see, when will she revive? I don't know. 
Stop seems to be hanging in there. I don't know what's up with that. How long it takes. Alright, so unstopped. Is it like some things where you're stopped until you're damaged? I don't know. Spiders! Why are you so angry? Is it because you have mushrooms on you and are possessed by fungus? That would make me angry too. They aren't probably, I think they're just angry spiders. Which I'm cool with spiders, so they should just chill. Why is Aurora so low leveled? Everybody else is like super leveled up, but Aurora's like, I'm way back here. I think I just, yes, I got rid of all the books. His home is fine. Apparently he doesn't like being around people. Spider stepped all over your plants. Do I get anything for it? What do I get? Okay. Oh, that's not bad. I get some stuff. Dude, thank you. You gave me stuff. I like stuff. Do I start riots? Princess riots. Best kind of riot. Oh, I don't want to fight you, Wolfie. Seriously, I'm not in this. I'm not. I'm not here to. Oh, I missed one of these. Have a questionable attention span, and you will always be surprised. Buy stuff. It's a lot. Got that one already. If you're wondering why I'm doing this, it's because there's something I want to check out here. Before you get to the Capilli village. Ooh. Well, it's not gonna let me go back down there, is it? I want to go down where that wolf is. I don't know if there's a way to drop down levels. I don't think there it feels to me like there wouldn't be because it would be counter to some of the exploration stuff they want you to do, but uh, there's nothing back here. That seems strange. Who am I to ask? There was a, uh, well, there was a troll here, and then, here we go. There are a bunch of things I didn't kill here because I wasn't strong enough yet. Griffin time. don't seem to have an elemental weakness, so. Oh, I forgot to put those weapon things I just got on. on. Oh, shame, shame me. Oh, I've been paralyzed. Eh. Hmm. It's an air creature. Air is usually lightning, I think. That's true. Oh, lightning water. I don't know. Oh, it's not as strong as I thought it was. Oh, Lola likes to make put things to sleep. Healing tonic. And before I forget, let's put this better stuff that I got back up, people. So these are, um, buffs.
And again, I tend to use them for <laughs> whoever I like. Well, so it's, yeah, it's points. Defend. Now I accidentally got him started on. The, no, I didn't. Okay, so he's where I want him to be. Kill I? She has a rough ruby on her thing. Attacks at 10%. That's pretty good. Let's put that on hers. So that's. They do different things depending on if they're attack or. Um, see? Like, Reduces magical damage by 10%, so we'll just buff her up. Uh, increase magic by 4. Oh, actually, I'd never use magic with her. It's 4 points. We'll do this one. And somebody else can get the extra tourmaline. Actually, use him in battle more often. Raph Sapphire adds water. That's not gonna. I don't think that will do much with him because he's. Um, I don't think magic is affected by that, but we'll see. So that should generally make him better. Quite. Ruby max 4P. This is good, okay. I don't see how she's. Let's look at the gesture real quick and see if she's making sense. Lightning damage to melee attacks is fine. It's fine. It's fine as well. Actually, max. Because magic before. Oh, no, I want this one. Since I'm using as a healer, it makes more sense. So I'm learning the mechanics, which means I'm more effectively making decisions on what I should be doing. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, huh. How did I miss that one? That one's just easy to get. Like I said, again, OCD. Sometimes I look some ways, and sometimes I'm like, I'm not giving in to my desire for completionism, and I miss parts. Can I go down here last time? Please do. I wish there was a detailed map that showed what you picked up and what you had. Because that could be useful. Ah, I forgot those were thorns. <laughs> I was bopped that to him a few times. This was me last time, too. It was like, oh, look! I'll have to whack myself into these things multiple times because that's smart. Let's see. And this is the way out, I think. I think I did. And there was another griffin, I believe. Ow! It's thorned. Thorned! I was overly cautious around the griffins. That's time. Although I have leveled quite a bit, so maybe they would have beat, uh, beaten. Uh, attacked me. Taken me out! Let's get my hit points up. No sense look on the gift horse in the mouth okay let's do a long cast I should call in the guy with the although I think she's doing fine I don't know why I thought the griffins were so much more sturdy than they were maybe I didn't have any damage resistances or things that were relevant at the time let's see he has a that one has a uh, cast buff up. Oh, I made it! Huh! Even despite the speed buff on that one. I should have interrupted it, of course, but I wasn't thinking. So I'm focusing on the other one. There we go. Hmm. Maybe I should bring Finn in. I'm still not sure if they're affected when they're not in the party. go up here last time. Okay, so if you're patient and go all the way up here, you can get some more treasures. So I'm not doing a bad job of clearing out the treasures. It's not perfect, but get some of them. Wow, I'm going really high up, though.
unexpected shenanigans. Where, where am I? Is this like a boss fight? Looks like a boss fight. Is this a bad idea? Probably. <laughs> Probably a bad idea. Let's go for it! Embrace my lack of wisdom. Come on, don't let that spider get there first. Alright, more spiders, that's this one. I don't know why I've decided spiders must die first. Considering my, I have a neutral opinion on spiders, but it's been decided. I think those are fire on the moon. I can't remember. Let's bring in another party member. I just haven't had him in here for a while, so. Ian! Finn, I don't remember what these are vulnerable to. So you want to wildfire that guy and see what happens? Oh, I should have done. I had time to do a long cast. I should have done it. Oh, that worked. I think we'll be able to beat this. Even if it's a boss, I think we'll be able to take it out. It's an air thing. Let's try lightning on it. Although it's made of wood, it looks like. Mm, got interrupted by that, but not. And I get turned off again. Cool. Let's try wildfire and see what happens. Probably win with this strike. I mean, it got severely disadvantaged in there, and I ended up in my cast bar. Defense Stardust! Uh, oh, so it just like is an extra boss to get me some stuff. Okay. Where has, oh, everybody's got some points now. So I've reached the end of her strength chain, I think. And <sighs> let's reach the end of that one. All right, so we did that. Wee! It'll be funny if that's a quest later, and they're like, "You are okay. You did that already. Cool. I mean, proactive." Don't fight with me, man. I don't got issue with tiny little bugs. Ouch. So the enemies they don't stay dead, I don't think. No, that's not lit up. I just look lit up because I have my firefly over it. That's a normal thing. Ah! A surprise beatering! Well, whatever. We'll take you care of. That's what we want to get him with. Let's get a spider wet. Oh, that one was actually faster than I thought it would be and it interrupted me. So I guess there's a, um, kind of a, well, I think I'm overpowered now for them. Um, there's kind of a benefit for getting in fights is you can pick up the hit points and things. I level up all the time. You're already at the end of this one, so I don't know what we can do now. This is defense, 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 dodge, counterattack, magic. A lot of the time. <coughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Um, uh, that one's open. I find that I the game will give me all kind games will give me all kinds of skills and stuff and usually um, only will use up 
you end up using a handful of things because, you know, don't really need them all. But, um, sometimes, like, hmm. again, one of the games I play most of the time is a massively multiplayer game, and that's a different s a story, because usually all the skills you give there in they give you in something like that are there to be part of a rotation. There are some skills that everybody's like, why is this here? And then you just ignore it, and then it goes, you lose it in a patch, but because nobody knew what to do with it, and then the developers are like, uh oh, oopsie. Um, I thought she'd come back. There was a crow here earlier, and I was like, I want to go see if the crow is, it's a pig with wings. Haha, <laughs> a flying pig. Um, it was a personnel, so the crow is indeed a personnel. That's why I came here. Palette generic rings. Oh, they like mint. We have established that. Oh, she, her pig ran off while she was a bird. him in the plains. I don't remember where the wind wheels were. I have no idea where the planes are, so okay. Okay, so it's not this flying pig. She's after another. Another flying pig. Let's see, map of Little Maria. Wind wheels. Okay, so that's where I was just recently was the wind wheels. Okay. What's up here? Is there anything up here? Nope. These people were previously birds when I came out. I was like, wait, I remember there are quite a few of them. Yeah, I think the stars were already... I found them in a, another place earlier. Can I go in? I could go in earlier, but again, birds was all I had. I already took the treasure chest. And they weren't like, uh, you turned us back for a bird, but you should have taken our stuff. Flappity. Let's see, there was somebody in here though. No, there's not anymore. There was a bird in here being angry at me, but I was hoping it was still here to be angry at me. It's not. I'm glad you people are all very pleased with my heroics. As you should be. As you saw, you can do instant travel. Sniff, 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 says I. Snottily snotting about. Okay, so this starts me back where I was at the beginning of these. I love maps. I wish this had like an internal map, but no. Let's see. Dun, da, 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 da. I broke that open already. Oh, there's the pig. That's just a pig with wings. Doesn't have the mark. <laughs> He's looking. Oh, there's a church over here. Sometimes I'm not sure what it's going on about. There's nothing here. Hmm. Ah, there's the 
the windmills if they were talking about. Switch in there. Ouch, so I have to be careful. Careful is for silly people who don't mind taking minor damage. I don't know what I just did when you opened the door. Oh. Can you be in my party? I am looking for always party members. Oh, so you have hair like mine. Oh, she has sisters? Like, I saw you dead. Whose mother? Is this her this is her half sister or adopted sister? Okay. Okay, so this is her sister, but I don't think her blood sister. I think this is her adopted sister. And then I'm totally confused by everything. She looks like I'm off. I guess if it has illuminated ink, I'll see it. It's one of these weird confessions. I think they're supposed to give me ideas into the back for it, but the rhyming convention makes it a little... Oh, do I have to get Nora up to speed? Clearly there's been contact between these worlds before. The human world and the not. I like her art. Alright, what can she be? These are all deep offs it looks like. I feel like that would be most intuitive for me. Yep, I don't know. That's good points. Anybody else have good points? Nope. Okay, let's get her some oculi. It's like a moth. I wonder if it's intentional. Entirely sure what I'm up to. I'm looking for 
pigs, and I'm looking for pigs. There's a door. Looks like somewhere I'm gonna have to go. Ah, okay, fine. Just, uh, I, oh, well. <laughs> I can't move this arrow and it pulled me to fight. I guess that makes sense. As much as anything does in a game like this. Angry rocks! <laughs> Let's take a risk and see if. I forget what Starlight does. If they pick me or something else is out okay. there. Something else is very cool. Um. Let's see. Water, fire, lightning, earth. I feel like lightning. Oh, he has a counter ability. switch them out because she'll do I want to see her in action and also she'll respond to um does she have a normal attack? Room. <laughs> Oopsie doodles! I forgot that I don't have my. Um, I was out teleworking earlier and I forgot that I don't have my computer plugged in, so let's do that real quick before I get my butt kicked by the outside phenomena that is my computer. So I'm like, I'm stopped. Because that will. That's, that's not part of the game design. There we go. I think it does a strike as well. Does it do damp? No. I mean, she's pretty. I like her. I like her design. Okay, so she does do damage as well as petrify. So he's going to fire. Yeah, they usually fight. Yeah, that's a good question. Hmm. Oh, interesting. She gave her magic ring. Just give me a recorder. How does it do that? I don't know. Ah! Let's see if I can. If not, do I have the hand eye coordination to do that? Yeah, I do. Okay. Here. So 
we have a windmill. And we must have to take that crate down. Somebody had skill points too. Who had skill points? Ah, she did. I have to start her down a new path. <laughs> it doesn't do the first part of the path. I didn't realize it doesn't automatically. That's funny. Oh, I guess that's the last part? I don't know. Who knows? Whee! Let's get this crate, which I assume I need to take down this pit. Because wouldn't that be weird in real life if you're like, oh my god, a crate! Better move it. Because I know I'm gonna have to. Hmm. To push it now. I've never had that in that impulse around crates, fortunately. There's some shipping companies in my town, so it's like good that I would probably be like, what are you doing? It's like, I saw you have crates! I had to push them! Oh. Okay. I didn't see that. Cool. Meal! Let's see, I think she has. I have... Like, I just keep... Maybe there's, like, a crafting? What's an oculi? Craft oculi. Oh. Cool. A rough ruby and a ruby and a ruby. That's my tip. How crap? Okay. Oh, I can get purple things, too. So. Let me get tumbled ruby. Can I take him back? <laughs> Let's make something purple. See what happens. That's nah, not it. So that makes a rough amethyst. Uh, crafted rough amethyst. Rough citrine. Citrine and a. I don't know, get you anything. Okay. Don't get you anything. Okay, so we can't really. Let's see what our citrine does. Light damage. This is physical damage by 20% when H3 drops from I don't know. That's nice. stuck in there. Oh, yeah. I'm a master of timing. Alright, got time to stop. I love switches. I pulled that! I think I was supposed to. I would have did. But I pulled that switch. Floating rock. I don't understand. Ah, ah, jeez, Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. Ah, I die. Not expecting that.
take a look at that in a moment. It's a permabuff. This is a door. Is a treasure area or the way I'm supposed to go? Uh, who knows? It looks like a treasure area. There seem to be like troves. Like, if you can tell, I don't like wasting time fighting. It frustrates me. Like, it's fine fight in games, but it's not my bag. Really. I see as we level up the fire flight. Gets his ability to buff you goes higher too. So you're not stuck like buffing by tiny numbers all the time. Like, I'm fine with areas that are just treasure hunting, but it's kind of. Timing puzzles can just be solved often by just like barge, barging through anything anyway. Like that, right there. I didn't pay attention to the fact that there's a timing. I didn't have time to notice. Guard your safety jealous there, just in case. Princess cannot just make self-destructive decisions, I guess. I think I actually got everything that I'm making this button press down for anyway. Because I could- oh no, I guess I didn't get the treasure dress. Double sapphires, nice. Like, you want some more treasure to go with your treasure? Oh, sure. I'll take all the treasure, seriously. I mean, sure. Funny they made you go in a door. 
door for that, though. Okay. Cool. Made out like a bandit! Troves like this. Trove. How often do you get to use the word trove? I don't know. No, I don't. Usually it's not in my regular vocabulary. Tumble tunnel angels. She's all up on tumbled stuff. Tumbled sapphire. Looks like she have sapphires. I don't know. You old lady are now wearing a lot of sapphires. I hope you feel honored. Let's see. Let's give him some. Do we have any tumble left? Oop, I got a new confession, didn't I? No! <laughs> I meant to escape, not eat. Hello again, place I just exited. Again, most of those are just, I don't think I know enough yet to understand what they're trying to get at. But, um. Uh. Oh, so is that just a shortcut? Yeah, that's just a shortcut, I think. Several ways down there. These rocks are weird. Why do they float? I have so many questions. I just want to find one pig with magic ink on it. That's all I ask. This thing swing. Oh, okay, she's just coming in the background. That's where we need to go to go back to the real world. If I found my sister in a fantasy land, we would be having a ball. Um. <laughs> we plays massively mo lots of rock. Is that an enemy? Is it just a creature? I think it possibly is just a creature, but I'm not gonna touch it. Um, uh, we play a massively multiplayer game together already. We play Final Fantasy 14 together, and it would just be a mess. We would just be a mess. It would be great. Um, I'm not sure we would immediately be worried about getting back. It wouldn't be top priority, number one. Like, we're adults, man. We've seen what adulting's like. <laughs> why, why in the world would you be in a rush to get back to the, our current society if you were in a fancy land that was cool and you could fly and do all kinds of neat stuff? I mean, go for it. But, you know, maybe, maybe I'm alone in this feeling? I don't think I am. Anyway. If my, sister, uh, if my sister loves most to jump off of things, that is her life, that is her goal, that is her purpose. Jumping off of things in video games. It is why, why she is. So it's open, and, um... Yep. It's 
Also, she would just be jumping off of stuff, and I would be being like, can I look pretty? <laughs> Is there stuff that makes me look cool? Uh, and probably, I would probably be worried about why we're there, and be like, you know, are we supposed to be saving somebody? And she would be like, this is, this, this is not, I don't care. I want things to jump off of, I want to fish, and I want treasure. Like, that's what I care about. And I would be like, that's fair enough. Cool. We can, we can handle these processes. Now the rocks seem to be vulnerable to just about anything I threw at them. Let's petrify a rock just to make it confused. It dodged. I'm hoping that it seems like if you have characters in fights with the other, the other that they comment. So I'm hoping that we can get some comments between characters going. I would also like her to actually hit something at some point. It would be nice. Not that I'm salty or nothing. Let's see. It was. I forget if it was vulnerable and fire or not. I think so. Yes. Uh -huh. So I guess Petrify is her basic attack, essentially. Oops, that's not what I meant to do, but okay. it just made a bad decision. It's AI flipped out and made a poor choice. Although it does counter physicals, so. Let's just knock it. Knock that rock! Oh, I guess that gives really little damage and it counters physical attacks, so eh, I won't do that again. So it really needs to be attacked by magic. to correspond to the characters of Grand. Is that Achilles? I can't tell. How do they know? I guess he has the magic ink. Oh, I just put him in my inventory. <laughs> That's impressive of me. Not sure how I managed that, but cool. Well, I got some stardust out of it. Even without returning him. Didn't see that either. There's another one. Yeah, let's hit them all. Stop. I don't really want to play any bosses if there are any. I played enough for the moment. Angry rock. Gotcha. I do have to say, combat generally seems to be avoidable. You seem to be able to reap benefits of combat without having to um, 
fight things a lot, which is cool. I like that. So I guess crafting must be how you make most of your weapons, because I seem to get a lot of extras. So I should sit down and improve my stuff at some point. Another one of these guys. We don't know what these are for yet. Oops. Oh, we got a pirate. There would be something up here. It seems like that would be a re you would get rewarded for that, but I guess not. No, you don't have to talk to her. All right. Apparently, in the game you can force saving. It does auto save, but you can force saving by doing things. Anything that makes the save icon appear in the corner, which is stuff like. Um, use Ocul you equip new oculis and that kind of thing. Craft oculi. We should probably craft. Let's use some of those. That was the save icon down there, so we should be saved and ready to go. So let's exit the windows. Next time we'll talk to this person who looks like a pirate. That's it for the moment. Later.